have just cut out the whole glorious comedy from earlier. <laughs> Welcome to another episode of Bourbon Booze. It's cocktail day, Friday, one of our favorite days. This one's been a struggle. Okay. Yellow man over here is driving me nuts. So hopefully you enjoy what we do. Make sure you do hit that like and subscribe. It means a lot to us. Uh, we're about ready to start a new cocktail that Cody's come up with for the tenth time today. So I would say it's more not done research to see if somebody else already did it. Okay. Because someone else probably already did it. Somebody probably did. All right. So what do we got going here? I don't know what we're calling it anymore. Are we still calling it the idiot? Sure, it's yours, the idiot. Gin old fashioned martini, idiot. The idiot gin old fashioned martini. There we go. The idiot gin old fashioned martini. You and your names. All right, so we got some gin going on here. How much gin are we doing? So we're gonna do two ounces of gin. Two ounces. We're making a double, so did four. Not sure that glass or, well, maybe. I didn't know if you were gonna have enough room. Two ounces of gin. He's got a shaker full of ice we just put in. And then half ounce of simple syrup. This is an in dev in development. Okay, Top half ounce of simple syrup. So this is the first time tasting it in this one. Two ounces of gin, half ounce simple syrup. Or almost a half ounce. Let's just go with almost a half ounce. Almost a half ounce. Very scientific. Then gin, simple syrup, bitters. What kind of bitters? Uh, Fee Brothers Old Fashioned okay. Aromatic Bitters. Some aromatic bitters. One dash, two dashes. One dash. So a half dash. Yeah. Like just, just okay. To desire. So right now we just have a basic gin oh. cocktail. And a spritz of absinthe. Let's go within the glass. Okay. Spritz of absinthe in the glass. Shake. What? That's what remind me. <laughs> he didn't have his mic on. Yeah, but it'll pick up off your Yeah. Way. Okay, shake it, strain it. Looks dirty. It's frothy. Or it's a pink marking. Hmm. I didn't expect it to be that yeah. color. It's because of the uh, old fashioned bitter. I know, but you only put one dash in. It thinks, yeah, it makes it pretty pink. Okay. And then you got that absence spray. What are we doing? Nothing else. Oh, nothing else. So a basic, um, let's just call it a... Who knows what? Let's call it the who knows film? what. Sure you have a film on top? It's, the it's so weird. It's frost um, or it is. film or... We'll call it a basic uh, absinthe gin crystals. martini. I say we call it the who knows what. So it's it's nice and cool. It's very proponent on gin. So if it's, you don't like gin at all, then you're not going to like this. The absinthe give it a nice, and probably that bitters gives it a nice little twist. I actually love this. Yeah, it needs to be light on the bitters, otherwise you end up with that bitterness that un overpowers everything else, and not even the flavor of bitters. So it's just a basic gin martini with simple syrup. A little bit simple syrup, uh, aromatics, some old fashioned bitters, and then a spritz of absinthe. This is, this is really good. Mm -hmm. Finally got it right after what? Let's see, I did four by myself and then three more. <laughs> Off you. <laughs> I came up here early one day, figured someone might be awake and we could try cocktails for making so, a cocktail and they slept in. Yeah. And I had four by myself. So we're gonna basically call this the, um, a... I say it's the who knows what. Fine. The who knows what, a absent gin martini. There we go. I, this is spectacular. 
it's finally light. nailed it because yeah it lingers well mm -hmm. it doesn't get any more bitter it just kind of mellows out this might be my favorite that's pretty candy. good i might try this with the vesper you know side by side because i really like the vesper but this if is... you try it with mint it tastes like mint did you put mint bitters in one of these the first time yeah. It was very sweet and very minty. It was good, but it was very I minty. I would stick with this. So yeah. Tell us what you think. Is there a real true name for this? Because you know he just comes up with this stuff and I play along. So tell us what you think. Man, there's too many things. <laughs> Make sure you check out all of our other videos Monday through Thursday. We do uh, all sorts of reviews of uh, different styles of liquor on Mondays, but Tuesdays and Thursdays are reserved for whiskey or flavored whiskey. And of course, on Wednesdays, we try to do coffee most of the time or coffee related things. Um, we did do a special um, whiskey episode this past Wednesday. There's my dog barking. And then on Fridays, obviously, for cocktails. Hopefully, you have a great weekend, um, a nice, productive, sunny weekend. Uh, remember to hit the like and subscribe. It does mean a lot to us. Check out Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and TikTok, as well as merchandise. And we will see you on um, Monday. Cheers. That's really good.